Hi, I'm Jay Patel, a sales engineer at Hayfully Hypertronics, and today we're going behind the scenes to look at a live demonstration of the Axos 8 Compact Immunity Test System. Before we begin, it's important to stress safety. Please follow all company guidelines for safety as well as PPE gear. Additionally, follow all testing procedures outlined by EMC standards or by your company. The Axos 8 is capable of performing surge combination wave, ring wave, EFT or burst. With additional accessories, you can also perform telecom wave, magnetic field, as well as AC and DC voltage dips and interrupts. In this video, we'll cover surge combination wave test in standard mode of operation as well as pre-compliance mode of operation. Let's start with the connections. On the rear panel of the Axos, the Axos power supply, the ground, con ground connection, and the EUT power supply must be connected to the line, neutral, and ground sockets. You can hook up your EUT to the CDN output in the designated line, neutral, and PE connections. In order to gather test data, a USB flash drive must be inserted into the USB port. Once test setup is complete, you can save a file by selecting File and Save or Save As function. Additionally, a file can be loaded from our built-in standard test library. Let's begin with a 1 kV surge combination wave test. All parameters are entered to the touchscreen, such as peak voltage, line synchronization angle, repetition rate, as well as a number of surges. Let's do a 2 kV test at a line sync angle of 90 degrees, repetition rate of 6 seconds, and one number of surges. Additionally, we'll select all available coupling paths. Let's begin the test. While the test is active, the unit interface shows the charging time, the peak voltage, peak current, coupling path active, and the number of pulses. Additionally, while the test is active, you can pause, continue, or stop a test. The surge voltage and current monitor reports can be used to view the actual waveform. This helps you to see the peak voltage, rise time, as well as pulse width. While the test is active, the blinking LED lights display the currently active coupling path. For instance, line to PE is currently active. Next, it switched to the N to PE for our third pulse. After a test routine is completed, all data can be saved by hitting the report key. Now that we've looked at the standard mode of operation, we'll look at the pre-compliance mode. This can be accessed by pressing the search, test mode, pre-compliance. In pre-compliance mode, tests can be initiated and any parameter can be changed on the fly, including peak voltage, phase angles, and the pulse duration. If you want to set to a direct value, you can do this by pressing the actual number and setting a direct value. Additionally, each coupling path can also be changed. This makes it a great tool for debugging and finding mo issues with the EUT during the design phase. Once testing is completed, all data can be gathered by pressing the report button. Remove the flash drive from the Axos 8 and insert it into a PC. The file is in a CSV format which can be opened with Excel. To recap, Connect the ground cable, EUT mains power, and the Axos 8 mains voltage. Ensure the ground cable is connected to a proper earth ground and that the EUT mains power is turned off at the source while making the connections. Insert a USB drive to save test data. Power on the Axos 8 compact test system and connect the EUT to the single phase coupling decoupling network. Set the appropriate test parameters. This includes peak voltages, polarity, coupling paths, phase angle synchronization, number of pulses, and frequency. Start the test. Ensure that the EUT is under strict observation in the event of failure, and remember that a test can be paused, resumed, or stopped. At the end, you should retrieve the data by removing the USB flash drive and inserting it into a computer. Check out our website for product demo videos as well as data sheets. For additional information, please contact us at the number below. Thanks for watching.